With that, um, I invite you now to, if you would like to close your eyes and just imagine yourself sitting on the surface of Mars and listening to, to the surroundings. Uh, if I could have the first one, please. So that gentle whirl that happens in the background, that is a noise made by the rover. But yes, what you did here 10 seconds in was an actual wind gust on the surface of Mars, picked up by the microphone, and sent back to us here on Earth. The analysis indicates that was around a five meter per second type of wind gust. Um, so we have actually, we can sit here now and, and actually tell you that we have recorded sound from the surface of Mars. So we have a second one, which basically further reduces the noise of the rover so you can just hear uh, what the wind would sound like on Mars. And once again, I invite you to, to sit back and uh, have a listen to what it would sound like to be on Mars. It's just, it's cool. It's really neat, overwhelming, if you will. Um, I can't remember what I was going to go and say next. Um, so we're looking forward to doing some amazing things with the microphones going forward. We need to work with the ops team. There's some great science that they're, they're looking to do. We're hopeful that we continue to use these microphones, both the SuperCam microphone and the EDO cam microphone, to capture sounds, perhaps the rocks interacting with the surface. I know SuperCam is going to use theirs to get some great data of uh, them zapping rocks. So uh, as you've heard and we'll continue to hear, we're just beginning to do amazing things on the surface of Mars.